news, the Boston music scene had its uh, Battle of the Bands, the Rumble, and my band was supposed to be in it, and um, I kind of had a uh, epiphany. I worked at BCN for three years. The first thing you find out when you work at BCN is local bands are only allowed to be played on Sunday f nights. Can you believe that? I decided to um, talk about corporate radio that night and, you know, the evils of it and how, you know, they should be playing more local bands, you know, during the week. You know, even though they were having this event where they were supporting local bands. Everybody plays these bands at the same time on Sunday nights because we're in the f Matrix. Kind of had what, um, you know, the Boston Phoenix referred to as a nervous breakdown by Alston's most bitter hipster, in their words. When they get comps for all the shows when Lincoln Park come around here, for all their business people to f*** their chicks at, so they can put 200 spins a week for Lincoln Park. But it kind of was, uh, sort of, um, seeing the signs that maybe I should, uh, take a little bit of a, uh, we'll take it down a notch. Jay, don't Jesus. be creepy. Why are you creepy? We're looking for flaky puffs. <laughs> what is your problem, dude? Good digestion, good digestion, good bowls, good laugh, good pride. Why aren't you having fun like Boston? Why aren't you having fun? Not, period. Because you're not brutal anymore. <laughs> it's time. Maybe disturbed isn't angry. Yeah. Oh, how's your elbow? I decided to start getting in touch with um, friends again that um, I haven't been really keeping in touch with. I brought my uh, friend Bossum over today because he just got back from Europe. Like his f***ing band, the Cominas, just played the BBC. Well, I'm done with tubes, vacuum tubes, super vacuum tubes. Because I've been uh, going through different phases, you know, sort of a focus down, you know, buckle down, surround myself in the darkness phase. Right when you wake up from the dream in the middle of the night and you just have to just go out and find your, you don't know where your father is, you're just awake and you have mm. to like leave the house. I just felt like I could relate to that. Rob and I used to hang out all the time, we played Sega Genesis, you know, it was zombies ate my neighbors and smoking weed. I have no bullets, I'm at your mercy, I am. Listen, that's why I'm the man. Look. Then all of a sudden he started dating this girl named Sarah and he started like slipping into this like dark gothic phase. And then like I just forgot about everything but what was going on on the screen. It's just a phase of just being, I was focused in like the crow. The ninjas jumped out and all you seen was the hands and they had the, 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 the stars on them. Yeah. I used to pick them f***ers off. Just, I love that. I really didn't understand and I kind of thought it was a little cliche. Just gotta find a way to scrape by on quarters. I was a street fighter too, and like New York bagels. You know, I guess it was keeping him motivated and happy for a while, and I'm not really sure what happened. Today I'm uh, hanging out with uh, an old friend of mine, uh, Casey. The last time I saw him, he was a little shaky, and uh, you know, I heard he had a conniption because he's going kind of crazy. It switch mask. <laughs> Take that f***ing girl and get her in the past. You're gonna get <laughs> some ass. ass. You know, I just figured we could hang out again and catch up and like, um, you know, talk about um, all the things we used to do. We played Genesis. Uh, yeah, I'm not too sure what I think about that, but um, I guess he's coming over today and I haven't seen him in a really long time. You look great. Look at the boots. Oh, uh, thank you. Oh my god. Got him at Buffalo Exchange. Oh, oh. What's the matter? I'm stoned. I've read yeah. like so much about you like hitting it out of the park musically the last couple of weeks and stuff, and it's like I, re I really thought the rumble was going to be like is this close Nelby? Yeah. Oh sorry, I mean I just know how much you love him. I'm just a simple man. I'm a simple man. Well, you, you, you can hit the high note, I can't. Doing the best I can. Oh, and I, I, I sang... No, not that. Yeah. No. I sang the Boston music scene. The Boston music scene is sh on my dreams. And how did that go over? It didn't go over well. I, I didn't think so. One paragraph, once a year. You better pay a publicist or you're gonna be driven to tears. You were the first one I played it to. Like, remember like eight months ago and it was like after yeah, I played the All Asian? Yeah, before Well, I... went into your, uh... Quirky little goth phase with Sarah. So like girls, girls. I actually met this uh, really, really amazing girl at a party a couple uh, weeks ago. Her name's Sarah Hagen. She um, does uh, comedy in Boston. Yeah, see? Yeah, I, that's really fun. Yeah. I'm Sarah. Um, met Rob 
at a rave. It was like 4 a.m. He came up to me. I know he likes me already because he handed me like 12 water bottles and I didn't even take any ecstasy. So I don't know. I don't know what that was about. Like she went to Emerson. Emerson can't go back. I really kind of burned my bridges there. Like literally, like put a cigarette out on a professor. Not really can't even get my backpack back from the campus. Tried magic. Here's the two. Two of hearts. My heart's broken so we're putting it back in the deck. Do you want to see a card trick? Do you want to cut? No? No? I don't know. My dad doesn't even believe in magic. He says it's not out there. Um, and I'm like, magic's everywhere, suck face. I, I don't know what you want. I'm really just excited because I feel like, you know, after coming off of uh, my last brutal relationship, I'm ready to blossom. Ten of diamonds. Was this your card? No? It's the only time I'll ever see a diamond because nobody's marrying me. Here's a queen. Here's a king. They're doing good together. They're doing all right. We'll just add something else. Oh, it's a jack. Apparently the jack's younger than the queen. And now the king doesn't like queens anymore. He's just running off with a young boy. Nobody cares about card tricks anymore, you know? So, <sighs> comedy, I guess. It's time to laugh. I know you're like a vegetarian and shit. Have you ever gone to Grasshopper? Uh -huh. Yeah, all the time. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, it's good. And um, what are you doing? Oh, no, I just... Uh, improv ideas. She just brings out the childhood spirit in me, not like the weird childhood spirit, like a Michael Jackson stuff, but like a very whimsical boy who's not overly gay. I'd love to like work on ideas for you and stuff. I mean, yeah, because you see here, that's like a great, like, that's like hand mannerism number three that you, because I've been writing them down, so that's a good one. What yeah. do you mean hand mannerism? Funny. This is real life right now, like yeah, you but that's hanging real out. Life's this funny. isn't comedy. I mean, this is like. Office is supposed to be real life. Everybody loves don't, that. Don't, don't compare the sh**. Why don't we just see what so happens when we hang two. out? We've been doing a lot of fun things. The Topsfield Fair is in a couple weeks. I mean, I know I'm in Austin, and I know it's like Okay, a... we buy me a candy apple? Yeah. yeah. All right, cool. You like candy apples, and it's just like, man, we should, we, that fair I'm was... I'm starting, I'm putting that down, because candy apples, just the phrase, is really, that's, <laughs> that's really gold. I'm going to put that. Our Your funny. instincts about, like, comedy, yeah. it's, it's mesmerizing. I don't listen to Robert Smith anymore, and I, I am certainly not in my goth period. I haven't been to the Man Ray in six months. I am Sarah. What about Sarah? Um... Oh, we had a show last week. Sh show. This is how this is a Total sh I embarrassed myself, is what I'm saying. Embarrassed myself with Rob. You still got six and a half minutes. Right? No, no, I'll sit up here alone. That's great. That's then great. sit up there. You no, want to be alone I'm anyways. The one, I'm the one that performs. You're the one that writes. Ten of my friends from my improv group were there. We're wasting time. Yeah, yeah, you look pretty f depressed. I've got four pages of notes to go over, but I already hear f music in there, little tinkly fairy sounds and laughing. This is uh, King's Quest Four this time. So Amanda lives next door to me, which is in f incredible. Right. Uh, we've been smoking a sh load of of uh, so uh, tobacco. Fun. Type talk to okay. King. All right. What's up, dear? Notes. We've, we've got notes. I know we got f notes, but we've got comedy to work on. But it's improvising. We're gonna up King's Quest because I know how funny that is. But you know, if we could go well, back it's, to it's, this, it's, it's, it's like watching. No, a movie. I'm sure. I'm sure. With enough pot, I'm sure it's hilarious. But tobacco. I actually have stuff to do. With no. enough tobacco, I'm sure it's hilarious. Well, why don't you even want to hang out with me anymore, man? Because I mean, we've got work to do. Did, were you there? You were there. But did you? Seriously, somebody put a f***ing in her mouth. Would you relax? Yeah, I work good Rick, I Rob, need the DVD. Don't touch me. This is a clean club. You, you do not. Again. You touch me again. I, I am not playing. That was awful. Well, because you're freaking out that on was stage. Awful. That's freaking You're freaking out. out. It's stage. comedy. Enough with the notebook. I've spent enough time with you that being you yourself, not funny. And I'm putting that in the notes, too. That's note number one. Not funny. I love video games because they take me to, like, this place where I can just be in the game, and it's just so surreal to me. She has to go on a, a little uh, trip. Uh, uh -huh. All right, if you could get back to talking I think to this me, is the... because... We played King's Quest together. And... Who's Amanda? By the oh, way, is this, she... Okay, oh. I'm sorry. Hi, yeah. I live two houses down. Oh, her Amanda. Amanda. Hi, her yeah. name's Amanda Cupcakes. That's your Christian name? It's just such an amazing game. We bump into the same Shaws together at Brighton Mills yeah. across yeah. the street. Yeah, yeah. yeah because yeah. she's two houses down, and who knew that the we grocery were store was three houses down? And we down. bumped into each other. Right. You remember what kind of Pop-Tarts, though? Pop Fudge Shop. We both like Pop-Tarts, which is amazing. No, but I thought we were going to work on, like, vegetables, and you were going to take me to Grasshopper, and we were going to... Yeah, but you're we too... 
busy at night doing no, imp improv asylum I on Monday. I penciled you in. Tuesday night, 8 o'clock. I said I have time from 8 to 8.45 exactly. It just seems different, man. You know what your nickname is becoming what, around the apartment? What, what, I'd love to know. What Sarah Sh Show. And whose fault is that? Amanda Cupcakes beat Sarah Sh Show. Uh-huh. Well, oh, have fun God. with Cupcakes and King Quest. Because I'm actually going to sit here and work on some Do you want to play too? No, I don't. I really don't. This isn't being an adult, is uh, all I'm going to say. Amanda, We've got cupcakes and fairies and Pop-Tarts. In 8th grade, she was in, uh... That's great. The, yeah, uh, we were all in 8th grade, and it was hilarious and ironic, but we're not now. Did you yeah. make somebody's milk come out of their nose? Is that, is that funny? She looks like you. She does. God, there's no coincidences with Sierra games. That's fantastic, because blondes are always fun, aren't they? This is what as real as any movie, any, like... Any Bible or fairy tale you've ever heard? What, because the princess is blonde? Has there ever been a brunette one? No. No, because Never. they're cranky. Who wants cranky yeah. brunette? I don't like my throne. I don't want my... I'm a very angry brunette. It's not they're cranky. It's that they get stuff done. So I'm getting, like, hot. Well, whatever happened to you know, a little, little magical lady who was saying, like, you know what, I see myself one day moving to Vermont to being domesticated. Are you kidding? You took that seriously? I love the woods. I love being in nature. We can go camping. Do you want to go camping, Rob? Let's go up right. to New right. Hampshire okay. and talk right. about the plans we made. Read the notes later. Pop tarts and no Gatorade. Pop -tarts. No more. You hate Pop tarts and Gatorade. Sarah met a, a, a young man who's ambitious with comedy. Yeah. We're about to sail on Willow's yeah. New England. Yeah. Oh, New England. Ay, 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 ay. Actually, I brought someone with me. This is Matt. I, I just felt like we needed an advisor. I don't think Sarah likes me the way I like her. Which I do. You went to Amsterdam for like a whole year. Yeah. That's like five notebooks. Well, and we know what someone else would have done if you'd gone to Amsterdam for a year. It's not just like, you know, I mean, you can put the same imagery into music as you do with movie imagery or, or, or from this. Rob. And... Hey, what? Hey, what? Hey, hey, hi. Yeah. Sarah! Hey, everybody! It's Sarah... <laughs> Sarah Hagen. Uh, you brought a friend. That's Matt. Matthew, everybody, Matthew. Uh, who's Matt? She makes everything timeless, you know? I mean, usually I'm like a restless, you know, creative type doing a lot of, uh, of, of Percocets. You're doing comedy with us. No, he's doing improv, <laughs> actual improv with us. Actual yeah. improv. Yeah, because what you're doing is not funny and it's not improv. I thought I got better at the show we did last week. No, you didn't think so? What'd you think? Sarah, when I'm around her, I don't want to do drugs, but she's popular and she's busy. It's a lot of medicine. I got 15 songs going. I haven't slept in I'm going to give you my car keys. Why? You drink so many energy drinks, I'm going to give you my car keys. No way. No way. We actually have stuff to do. We have stuff to do too. We're trying to figure out the philosophy behind video games. It's all about professional atmosphere. Okay, I know. We should have a professional atmosphere where you meet people. This is Bosom. He does improv comedy too, and he plays incredible band. Mm -hmm. I beat Zelda, Ocarina of Time, with three hearts. And she has this vision for how our comedy, it's comedy, it's free. It's like undefined, like art and love and, um, and, and food. Rockstar. He's a child. He's a giant, unopened bottles of vitamin because he's a giant child. But yet the Rockstar drink is He's always high. And honestly, he's just kind of... Strange. I want to have bad outfits and mustaches that are frozen in time. You get punched and you can't get back up. You just, just, I just want to, can I just get some water? Where the f*** Sarah? She's in your room. Well tell her to come out first, we're doing the party. Yeah, I, I want to get some water for her too, but she said she didn't want it from the tap. Do you have any? It's the same water out of the Here. tap that it is out of a f***ing bottle, dude. It's fine. So what type of comedy are you thinking you should add to our improv troupe that me and Sarah are very happy doing together? He's a strange guy. Like a lot of like lights and dancing and just happy songs like Buddy Holly combined with just this very innocent, ooh, Austin. Do you f have a, 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 an act or something? I make Do you have you try these with applesauce? I don't think they're vegan. We're watching Seabiscuit, director's cut, in the f living room in 20 minutes. Instead of the stupid improv, like, I do, we'll improvise it. Who's seen Seabiscuit? 
Thank you, yeah! I love you, Miss Kate! Do it, it loves you too, it's like... She lives in Lower Alston too, her name's Amanda. Her last name is Cupcakes. Like cupcakes, like food, which is undefinable. <laughs> it's just a very good movie. It's See, straight Hollywood crap. No, it isn't. It's about a little horse. The horse got stronger because it found a magic sword and one day it killed the that hipster boy the who dated the pretty female princess horse in the it's movie. It's just about a racing horse. You're dating her. <laughs> That's awesome. I'm yeah. just gonna break her. She water. is awesome. She asked for the water. I'm yeah, like, she's... I'm, I'm, I'm leaving now. Yeah. Gonna watch Sea Biscuit. You can um, tell your new wife that um, she can watch Sea Biscuit too. Sea Biscuit, not funny. Room looks like a hellhole. Not professional. Singing songs again without working on parodies. <laughs> just let. Just come in. Why are you letting her, f you know, take the fun out of comedy for you? Oh, I think comedy is very fun. I yeah. think that's where he'll to probably the, be best. Right. You guys yeah. are dating. Yeah. You'll be able to shine. Yeah, that's yeah. what he said. He, yeah. You're dating. Yeah, yeah. And when so were you gonna, when were you gonna, when were you gonna tell me that? I think it's just fun because we'll be. What am I not here? What is it? Like, be the best. Sam Wheat yeah. from yeah. Ghost. Well, we have a lot in common. I mean, it's just so do we. We clicked. We both like candy apples. Yeah, that's kind of died down. It's a once a year thing, and that time is over. Also, candy apples are really bad for your teeth. Those are fine. Hello, there's a human boy in here. Why don't you go watch Sea Biscuit out there, Rob? Yeah. Did you hear? Did you hear what he actually thinks the movie is about? No, f this is yeah, my bedroom. He, he thinks it's about. I'll see you guys at the horses. comedy studio for our show. Well, you know what? That we can actually use. We should just use that. And uh, they moved out to L.A. I would say it's time we had another well, show. Well, you know, we come here and there's another party. Yeah, of course, you know. Same thing that happened. And where was he? He was like somewhere down there to stage. No, five. you know where he was? He was all over the you're place. Right. You're right. He was. He was all over the place. That pretty much sums him up. Yeah. I think. So yeah. he's gone. Um, and we're moving to LA. You'll finally get to meet Bob Wiggenbaum. I know. I'm, He's the best. I'm really excited. People have called him the genius behind Animal Planet. But see, that's why we click, because I'll say, like, say, funny fruit. Funny fruit. Exactly. See? You don't say a fruit, and that you expect it. You yeah. recognize my talent. He you recognize said, my genius. He would have said banana, because it's like a penis, uh -huh. and it's juvenile. And on what career of time? Yeah. Hey, What's up? Hey, buddy. He, he Hold on. Band practice. Now when practice is important, you're here. Well, it's important when you have fun. Yeah, we actually need to talk to you. Okay, one second. Oh, oh man. Sarah, Sarah, sh time. Oh, man. Yeah. Yeah. Sarah, sh yeah. show. You remember? Hey, okay. that could be a song for the band. Sarah, sh show. Sarah, sh show. Sarah, sh show. Die, die, die. Whoa. Our yeah. yeah. show says right. we need to talk. I think if you're going to have Matt in the improv troupe, I can have Amanda. Well, can you hey, hold on? Hi, we we're don't doing our really album cover care. for the Oregon Trail. That's nice. Right. Get a shot of sh show, you know, Sarah, for the... Uh... Hi. Yeah, we we actually have stuff that we need to talk about. Yeah, get one down. Yeah. Yeah. You're like, yeah. summer. Oh, right. we, yeah, I mean, we should talk. Before we, no, we yeah. need to talk right now. Okay, so, now, improv it. comedy, we got to work on it, there's no, some notes. No, it's not, it's actually not about, what? we're moving, so we're just saying bye. Were you moving to Somerville or Brighton? No, we're out in New England, we're going to L.A. Why? Why would we stay here? It's, that's come back. We have an opportunity. Yeah. Uh, just that's, one. Yeah. Are we improvising right now? This if we, isn't a joke. If we had been improvising, we would have practiced and had a time. Do you guys want to be on the album? No, I really yeah. don't. Let's go. Sarah, I wrote this song with Sarah for you. So, oh my god. Sarah, are you serious? Sarah. No, I really can't hear another person. Wow, I, I can't wait to hear this song. Sarah. I was joking about some of the stuff. I, I, I dig you. And we're going to make the new comedy no, Seattle I, here. No, let's not. Can I just play a song? Guitar. No, 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 no. You like you it? You made me hate it. Rob, done. get off the drugs. I don't care about you a lot, but I care about you sort of. And okay. look at you're wearing, you're wearing a, a red a whimsical wool hat. Outfit. Oh, Sarah. And the, the scarf. Is don't 85 let me degrees down. out today. You have a look, just too. Just get it together. So, There, um, and, and, and it didn't work out. Sometimes, like, you know, the princess is in another castle, you just gotta plow it down. One, 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 two, one, three, one, four, two, one, three, yeah. two, three, two, four, three, one. But, um, 
your hands are just... Maybe this will cheer you up. What kind of weed is that? <laughs> We were gonna cover this song. Why didn't we cover this song? Ah, uh, because I went through a dark period. I want to wear colorful colors. Next time I come over, I'm gonna be more colorful. I mean, you know, I mean, uh, Sarah's happy now. I mean, I don't know where I'm going. I couldn't even get the band to the rumble. Okay, I'm in the now. Oh, oh. I just thought it would be nice. Oh. You know, you need to change from this. I know, but but you but, know, but, you're like dope, but, but, dopey. I don't want to be any more. The dwarf. That's gothy. See, this is. Why, no, why this am I dopey? Is handsome. Because I'm high? No, because of your well I'm the, not dopey. the I'm way what? you wear your hood. I mean your what? ears stick out like Like dopey? No, you mean Dumbo. Yeah, they both have big ears. <laughs>